Welcome to Rick Snyder's Washington on YouTube, where you get the whole story. So please like, share, subscribe, comment, even hit the thanks button. BetMaryland.com, they come up with a lot of unusual polls, and they came up with one with which states like uh, certain foods the best. Well, as someone who wrote Secrets of Caveman Cooking, that really is my name there, I wrote this about 20 years ago. You can get it for like a buck on the Amazon used books. Anyway, I used to cook at a steakhouse, so I know a little bit about cooking over the grills. Uh, they ranked it. Maryland was among six states where everybody said wings are the best thing to eat on the grill, along with Georgia, Massachusetts, New Hampshire, New York, and Pennsylvania. So kind of a more, more of an East Coast thing, I guess. What was number one, though? Ribs. 19 states said ribs were the best, including Alaska and uh, Arizona, two diverse places. Hamburgers. Alabama, Oklahoma really liked their burgers among those. There were 10 states there. 10 states said hot dogs, including Virginia. Hot dogs? Listen, I, I used to love hot dogs. I don't eat them much anymore because uh, not as good for me. But, um, I mean, anyway, a good hot dog is good, but not as good as some other stuff. But West Virginia, Delaware also went along with hot dogs. All right. And then chicken. Five states went with chicken. Hawaii, boy, I bet their chicken's good. You know, I get a pineapple on it and all. That'd be really good. Montana, Vermont, some pretty diverse areas of the country went for chicken. I like chicken a lot, too. I mean, if you had, if it was, they asked me personally, um, the best thing on there, probably a burger. You know, I'd go burger, then wings, um, then a hot dog, chicken, and then ribs would be my least. So uh, I'm not as big a ribs guy as a lot of people are. But if you want to cook some food, change my mind. Hey, Dennis, you listening? Uh, you know, I'm glad to listen and talk it out. So, I'm Rick Snyder for Rick Snyder's Washington. Boy, the off-season produces weird stories, doesn't it? Anyway, thanks for coming. I'll see you soon.